about 100 people showed up for a town hall meeting at the Pueblo Convention Center today to question Republican Senator Cory Gardner. News size Katie Blaze was there. She joins us live in our Pueblo studio. And Katie, things got pretty heated at times. Yeah, guys, they did. Before the town hall even started, a small group of protesters were outside the convention center. The issues on their minds, health care, the DREAM Act, and for many, the tax reform bill. I just want to make this a better place for them. Joan English is back for another town hall with Senator Cory Gardner. As she says, it's all for her grandkids. I want them to live in a world where people don't have to go bankrupt for because they get sick. Health care, that's just one of the issues people in Pueblo are worried about. Let's repeal the Affordable Care Act, put in its place something that's going to work to lower costs, increase the quality of care. Another concern at the town hall. In Pueblo, there are many students here who are studying for school and whose um, immigration status is going to be revoked as soon as March. I'm on the bipartisan Dream Act legislation to try to fix that uh, to fix that problem as it relates to that challenge as it relates to uh, our, our, our dreamers uh, and certainly look forward to a bipartisan fix. Also on people's minds, North Korea's missile defense system. What is the Senate doing to try and get this situation under control? For Gardner, it's about going after companies enabling North Korea. You have a choice. You can either do business with the largest economy in the world, the United States or you can do business with a rogue madman in North Korea. Applause for that. But a lot of red disagree cards in the air for the tax reform bill. This rushed through tax scam will not benefit the middle class or the poor. Will you vote no on this tax scam? I believe it's important we pass a tax bill that provides relief to the American people. I think this tax bill is heading in the right direction. And other issues brought up, getting better care for veterans, also concerns about the elimination of the student loan interest deduction. Now, we do have the town hall in its entirety for anyone to listen to. Just visit our website at koaa.com. Watching out for you in Pueblo, Katie Blaze, News 5. Katie, thank you.